Hey guys, welcome back to more Justice 2 with the MJ406, Gonna have us one, and Double X Studios. I'm gonna go get some water, so enjoy, you know, battling to the death and all that. I'll be back. Of course. Of the course. Let's hijack his PS4. <laughs> yes. Oh crap, I hit the wrong button! Don't worry, we're good, we're good! <laughs> I was trying to figure out how you to change- You idiot! I was trying to figure out how to change costumes! Uh, I was trying to figure out how to change costumes with the turtles again. Um, I thought it was a loadout thing, but I guess I don't know. Uh, let me check a look. Yeah, we we just played the last episode. I already forgot. Oh no! What'd you do? Oh, I hit the share button. Ah! <laughs> Get out! <laughs> Damn it! I don't know how PS4 controller works. Uh, options? No. No. We're already fucking up everything. <laughs> Leonardo. Um, I'm guessing it is the uh, layout then because I'm not seeing anything else. Oh. Or loadout, whatever the fuck it's called. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Uh. Mmm. Mmm. Well, this is a nice opening. Yeah. Cool. Oh, you figured out something. Okay, there's Donnie. Yeah, it's the loadouts. Oh! Okay. And then nothing for Mikey. Oh, I guess it's just look, but they are basically the same flavor. Okay. Alright, then. In that case, I'll be... Okay, I think we show off every... Oh, no, we didn't show off Starfire yet. Oh, yeah, Starfire. Starfire. Sure, that works. Oh, I wanted the Teen Titans version. The old Teen Titans version. Alright. Bitch! <laughs> Alright. Stage. Choose. Oh! I thought I did already. I forgot I'm player two right now. Fighters approaching I still have to think about getting a PS4. Think about it. Because while they it, have... it seems like a Slaughter Swamp is like like the go-to place. Yeah, now. it's freaking weird. I mean, right now we're you're a turtle, so that makes sense. Why so bright eyed? Love this! I will not let despair dim my flame. You sound just like Leo. <laughs> Why does Leo have flames? Ow, oh, God! Well, I mean... With, like, um... Damn, I have to fight the new leader of the turtles. Son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah, congratulations, Parts of the Crime. You finally got it right. <laughs> yes. Oh, God. Yeah, got one. Yeah. I... I haven't checked out the new series yet. I've only seen the pilot episode, and does it look up? Is it okay? I mean, it's, well, I heard... dec it's decently act. I know people don't like the art style because that's art, what me art off. style is a little iffy, but I usually don't mind those. Art style of what? The new uh, turtles. Uh, the current turtles uh, series that's going on. Oh well, I heard uh, the animation's pretty sweet. Oh no! And, and the and, and I you know like I haven't followed it. Oh. Ooh! Turtle power! Cow bug a bitch! Oh, shell shocked! That was cool. I love, I love that. Now it's my turn. Damn it! I thought it blocked. Of course, we're going out in space. Well, I'll be in Starfire, so of course. Yeah. Jesus! Which makes me wonder, since apparently, okay, because I know in the, I mean, obviously the DLC characters were added later. I kind of do wonder something though. Since, um, wow, that's cheap Cyborg fuck. mentions in the story mode. Oh, look, it is like the video game. <laughs> yeah, that, uh, that Starfire and Beast Boy are just gone. So, um, how do they explain Starfire coming back then? Yeah. <laughs> she found a way. Oh, freaking. Well, oh, then again, in comics, like, uh, characters, they have their cop outs everywhere, they yeah. have their ex machina some way or one another. Just like an end game. It, it, it's like a it's, it's like a Toronto end, uh, 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 end game. You know, everyone knows great. Yeah. By the way. I mean, yeah. yeah. I agree. Um. Because uh, I'm trying to think when this would come out, uh, uploading wise. Because I don't know if it'd be okay. July. Okay. Um. Because. By this time, Spider Man Homecoming would have come out. So. <laughs> the Flash. Yeah, because I'm trying to think. Because usually my window of like at least with movies. 
is wait till it comes to home media before you can start talking spoilers. Yeah. Yeah, I I, I wouldn't uh, do spoilers of a uh... uh, end game just yet. Oh, absolutely not. Yeah, I mean, I mean, yeah, yeah. Well, that means we can talk about Infinity War. It was better! <laughs> Endgame was better than Infinity War. It's up in the air. I mean... Okay, look, the third act is far better. Well, yeah. Yeah, third act of Endgame is really good. I'm fast enough to knock you out. But not to outrun your doubts. I'll say there's one scene in the fight scene though. I will just say it made me go, oh, oh. I think I may know which one you're talking yeah, about. Yeah, you probably most people did. Apparently, it was some theaters are a collective size when they saw it. They're like, it feels a little forced, but you know what? I get why they did it, but it feels but, a little forced. But I I know exactly what you're talking about in that case. Uh, well, if you know what I'm talking, I personally think it was a still a, a good addition. May, yeah. Maybe would have a. Uh, Weaved in a little bit better, but still, I th I think a that more natural transition would have been nice. Is more or less what people thought. Exactly. Because right. he was like, it's like, oh, they did this just because. It's like, but, but like, still, but still, the follow up after with the uh, you know who's getting together that was still pretty awesome. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, we're good. All right. But yeah. Uh, overall, Infinity War might have been better, although Endgame's fighting scene the end. Oh yeah was freaking wonderful. Yeah. I, yeah, I mean... Oh, the very end, I wasn't... I was like, eh, with the very end. Which, you know, the which... funny thing is, is that I remember talking with people in in circles. Like, I don't remember who I said it specifically to. Um, it, It's something relating to... Uh, Tony Stark and Captain. Okay, yes. Go. Without going into too much... I mean, of course. ...into exactly what happens. I think. I did kind of predict... That one of them. ...that at least one of them was going to be in... Something. ...in this situation, where all the other one was going to be in the other situation to justify the continuation. Right. Of course. But I mainly just said it was going to be one or the other. I... I, I will admit, I did not see both coming of the plausibilities of what was going to happen. Ooh. Ah, Jesus. But I did I did say at least one of those things was going to happen. I mean, I did too, honestly. To, like, justify them continuing the Avenger movies without those two. I mean, it's basically going to be, like, a new set of Avengers, pretty much. Essentially. But and mainly, I, I kind of had a feeling it was going to happen. Like mainly Spider-Man, Captain Marvel, probably still Guardians. Damn yeah, because Guardians are still relatively new, so I can see them still continuing with them. Yeah. I did like Guardians. Yeah, I mean, I do I do love both of the Guardians films. Yeah, I know some people don't like the second one. I still thought it was... I mean, yeah. I, I, re I really enjoyed one. Like, honestly, I'm not that big with critics uh, criticisms and, like, heavy uh, weights on movies. Like, to me, like, if I enjoy the movie, you know, like... You know, that's all that matters, honestly. Like, that's the most I usually say is, like, I enjoyed it. Or I didn't like it, you know? Because it's just something that I personally like or dislike. I mean, I still think the first one was better. But the second one was still pretty good. Oh my god, we're actually going to somewhere that's not the swamp. <laughs> About time! <laughs> well, then again, it wasn't an option, so we won't know for sure. Thank god. What's this? Arkham Asylum starting to get to a swamp! <laughs> god! <laughs> <laughs> well, it kind of was like that in Arca in the Arkham Asylum game. I hope you like the new section of the cave, Batman. I've made a swamp section of the Bat Cave, Batman. <laughs> Alfred, why'd you do this? <laughs> because I am better than you, and everyone knows it. <laughs> Alfred, why'd you make it a swamp? You know I hate swamps. Exactly. Alfred, why are you gonna be a dick to me? Because I was powdering your bottom uh, uh, when you were a little baby, so I, uh, you are my bitch, essentially. This is the suit with the bat nipples all over again. Wait, that didn't happen. It's been a dream. <laughs> Damn it! 
I did it too early. Oh. Remember, it increases uh, your overall like attack when you hold down the button, like your attack for your uh, cold gun. Ah, oh, right, right, right. I just got. I always, I've been remembering that the circle button does your special like abilities. By the way, I highly recommend that you guys see Detective Pikachu in the I've already it's... seen it. I... Oh, you have? It, it was so much fun. I fucking called that twist, by the way. I, I fucking called it. Oh, woo. I by the way, very awesome. You just do just plant the bomb on your back. Ah! But yeah, that was a fun movie. Like, I was, I'm not that huge into the Pokemon fandom, and even I had a great time with it. Well, I mean, because, I mean, a lot of it was, I mean, a lot of it was... Well, Pokemon nostalgia, I guess. I mean, it's I mostly seen Gen it yet. One nostalgia. Yeah. Especially since there was a, like a lot of. Yes. Oh no! You blocked it. <laughs> <laughs> I finally blocked one, motherfucker. I saw the damage. I Woo! Damn. Ah, damn. Finally. <laughs> ah, you. Uh, as far as gunslingers, nothing beats the Red Hood. <laughs> damn straight. Of course not. Ah, uh, uh, you. You got too cocky. Oh, I saw the damage. I was like, I must have connected. But then nothing happened. I was like, oh, fuck. <laughs> Damn. And you know what the funny part was? I thought it was Captain Cole for like the first half of that match. That explains why the first half was really easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I still need to see Detective Pikachu. I... Oh, hey. It was, it was lots of fun. I mean, like... I mean... I mean, like... I think as far as live action video game adaptations goes, it's probably the best. I know, don't listen to critics. It seems most people that hate it don't really know Pokemon well. Yeah, I mean I mean it's gotten it got fairly well all things considered. Yeah. I mean, you know the cuz honestly I was cuz I went to go see it uh like premiere night right. uh with uh people from uh gaming club at uh, Bucks. And the like I told them like I told him, like, I'm predicting this major twist that wasn't really covered in the game, but there was, like, subtle hints right. to being the thing. And I'm thinking, like, if they're going to do it, it's going to be in the movie. If they're going to do it. And fucking called it. Yeah. Ah, uh, what a twist. That's very twisty. Oh, let's see this. Let me push this way. Your team could use turtle power. Yeah, uh, about that. Wait till you see it in action. Yeah, I'm just just because I'm green doesn't need I need your turtle power. <laughs> Ow. But yeah, the um but there was that like during the movie itself, like as soon as I as soon as I saw like uh a, setup. a, a certain a certain character, I'm like, he's the villain. I mean, yeah, I from what I heard the movie's not like too complicated. In, in, ter in terms of like As a movie it's okay, but like as a movie, it's like you can, you can see a lot of the tropes a mile away. It's more, it's like a fun movie, to my understanding. Like, don't think of it too much as a movie, but as it's Ooh. just it's fun. Did you just hit me out of it? Yeah, I did. You can do that, bastard. <laughs> That's range, man. Green arrows about range. I keep forgetting green arrow is one of your goodies. Oh. Damn it, Mikey! Yeah. Well, DC movies have decided to get better after freaking uh, Justice League is popped. Yeah. I, st I still enjoyed I Justice mean, League, honestly. Like, like as it, okay. it really got set up a, a bit oddly. Yeah, the setup was odd, I'll admit, but I still had lots of fun I with it. I think it was a fun movie. Just uh, well, Looking back on it, it's just music. like, there is a lot going against it. That's why Ma Mainly the villain. I mean, that's why they're trying to do a lot of standalone movies now. Instead of trying to make everything tie in, they're just like, let's just make a bunch of movies centering around one major character for now. So I think Justice League was a nice transitional period from the more, uh, quote-unquote, darker eras with the uh, movies. Because yeah, it kind right. of like, the Justice League movie did kind of like transition itself to more of a hopeful future. Yeah. Which I appreciate. And while, like, some of the actors might not be returning for future films, I still thought their performances were pretty good. Yeah, honestly, I was... Rest in peace, Batfleck. 
I was legitimately surprised by Ben Affleck's performance as uh, Batman. He I was w- good. He I was really good. I was a little worried at first when he was the first announced. I'm like, really? They're bringing him in? But... but again, again, it's all about redemption and stuff. You need, like, certain uh, aspects. And honestly... Morpha! Why do you say that name? <laughs> Yeah, it, 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 it was, it was <laughs> the point of that. Uh, though, like I, I take a cue from. I, I, I just went two in a row. Oh right, right. Yeah, I kicked his ass. Remember? <laughs> Sorry, I sometimes like watching you guys fight. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> like we just had our fight. Supergirl, Superman. Who had the better uh, CW show? Oh God. <laughs> I mean, probably Superman. Supergirl's pretty good too. I mean, like they, I mean Lex Luthor is in like the like the recent season. I have to binge watch the rest of that. I know the only one people don't like is the well, people somewhat liked Gotham, but not fully. It was like some things were the odd about it. Killed him, Cal. I took one life to save millions. Okay, General Zod. Jeez, oh. damn. <laughs> yeah, Supergirl wins that clip. Yes, and she better win the fight then in that case. Yeah, friggin', I know the only ones that, I know people didn't like most of the recent seasons of The Flash. Oh, no, no, the, the seasons have gotten a lot better. It's like, sometimes it's kind of like, uh, oh, yeah, like, like slow periods and certain things, you know, yeah. it's all about. I heard the villain was like one of the only good things about the latest one, maybe. Well, some people are really super critical about it, though, so. Yeah, and like, I, again, I don't do much with the. Uh, you no, know, following uh, critics. I just, you know, enjoy what I like. I know people. Yeah. Maybe I'm thinking Arrow. Maybe that's what I'm thinking. Mm, that could that, be a possibility. Arrow's been doing pretty well for himself too. I mean, like the last, it's gonna have its final season coming up soon. But still, it's it, it's the reason why there exists a CW verse. Yes. Yeah. It sounds so dumb. <laughs> it do, it kind of does. Ar- and Arrowverse. It's not gonna be called the Arrowverse anymore since Arrow's gonna be ending soon. Yeah. We caught on to your tricks. Guys, now, uh. Crap, what was the Superman one called again? Uh, Smallville. Smallville, yeah. People really liked that one. I, I did like the final episode, how they actually used the John Williams score. Yeah, that was a nice touch. Now, some people like Supergirl, some don't. I. I mean, I haven't seen it, so I can't judge for myself. But I'm going to take a wild stab in the dark as to why some people don't like it, and it's a very petty one at that. Oh, yeah, and you'd be correct. The same reason why people say, like, oh, Captain Marvel sucks, and why are you put into so much? Well, some people and, don't like Brie Larson in general because of political uh, of thing, reasons. Because of things she said in interviews, yeah. And here, here's the way I usually look at it. That was done... After the movie was already made. Yeah. If that was incorporated well, while the movie was being made, then yeah, that'd be one thing. It's more of a history in general people have with Brie Larson in particular, because she has political stances, and well, we know how those go nowadays. Oh, yeah. Yeah, but still, I thought the movie was great, and, yeah. and so many millions of other people did, because it's in the billion dollar club, so, oh, you yeah. know, like, you know, fuck the Which, which actually, speaking of which... Endgame Did past you... Avatar. Oh, yes! 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 Finally, the king has been dethroned! Yep. And I have an actual quality movie! Yes! Ha! Yeah, oh, sorry, Avatar James. sequels coming. <laughs> oh, uh, and like, James Cameron must be kicking himself right now. Well, then again, the only time, because uh, here's the thing, James Cameron already had the highest grossing film with Titanic, only to be surpassed by another James Cameron film. <laughs> it's like... Uh, I mean... I mean, saying what you love about the Avatar story, it was still at least a technical masterpiece. It, yeah, because here's the thing. The technology behind it was really good. It he, looked really the nice. main The main problem with Avatar is just how forgettable it is. Because yeah. it, it's a story that has been told millions and millions of times in a lot of elementary school. Oh, wait, hang on. Let me guess. We got uh, four more movies to go. Wait, let me guess. I never even see the movie, but let me guess based on what I know in the trailers, like... That there's a war going on. They need to infiltrate it, the war. It's basically Pocahontas. Yeah, that's what I've heard. It's basically Pocahontas. I've heard Pocahontas. That, yeah. The Avatar, the people that are like the. Oh, best. you got probably a random. What the fuck? <laughs> that was the second time I was random. I got him. That is fucking hilarious. But 
Another green character fighting him too. What the hell is this coincidence? Jesus. It's like it knows I'm playing. T U R T L E power. <laughs> yes. But yeah, but yeah, um Oh fuck, what, what was I at with that cramp? Um more than ready. Only one way to find out. I wanted to ride Reynolds Green Lantern. Okay, for that you die. <laughs> Even Deadpool doesn't want that. <laughs> You're welcome, Canada. <laughs> you were saying something about the Avatar movies? Oh, yeah. Being like Pocahontas? Oh, yeah. Yeah, the Avatar movie is basically Pocahontas. The blue people are uh, essentially the indigenous people, and the uh, humans are, well, the settlers. Mm. Yeah, I would say, I know it's been compared to, like, one or two stories. Pocahontas it, it, it's the It's mainly one Pocahontas. <laughs> it, it, it's essentially that. That same fucking bullshit uh, Thanksgiving story you hear, like, a million times. Yeah, of course. It's like, ow. It's like fucking, like, things like that. Fern Gully did a better job at telling a story like that. Damn it. And it had Robin Williams as a rapping bat. Yeah. Oh, speaking of Robin Williams, I don't know why this came to my head, but, uh, huh, how about the progress of that live action in the land movie, huh? I personally think that Will Smith is doing everything he can to do, to do the best genie that he could. He's trying to differentiate himself from Robin Williams. Well, at least he's not trying to be like Robin Williams. Well, and I can respect that. It's commendable, yeah. Yes. Well, here's the other thing, though, is that um, according to interviews Damn. with uh, the writers, the character of genie was built with Robin Williams in mind. Yeah. So it, it was kind of difficult to try and easily replace if he said no. <laughs> That's a Raphael thing, but okay. That's what they all do, though. Well, it's basically one turtle's character, just with costumes. That's yeah. all, so they just mix them all together. And on that note, uh, good night, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Yeah, that was awesome. Like, you didn't even get uh, down to your second bar of help. Oh. So you did well with Leonardo. He's getting good at the turtles. I should have figured. I should have seen this coming. Like I said, five-year-old me is so fucking happy.